Hi everybody, my name is Rachel and I am a self-taught cook who's been cooking since I was 11 and I learned from different family members, myself, and watching cooking shows on the Country Music Channel after school since we didn't have Food Network yet. And I'm in a lot of Facebook groups that you know, a lot of people are asking for recipes on how to do different types of foods. So I was thinking about coming on my Paper Chef channel page to help some other people. Why not? I have tips. I have how to use different appliances, recipes. We're going to break down a lot of different things on cooking and I want to start with just some of the basics, you know, like my favorite appliances, uh, making menus, you name it, we're going to try it, okay? Um, a little bit also about myself, I am a cancer survivor, and last year, it has actually been a year now, I am, since I was in the hospital, I could have died from my diabetes that I didn't know I had my blood sugar was at 1197 and if anybody knows knows your blood sugar should only be between like 85 and 110 on an average person so I don't know how I was still alive but I'm here I've beat breast cancer, I've beat, I am working on the diabetes and I'm doing extremely well. So some of my recipes are going to be kind of keto friendly, diabetic friendly, a um, little bit healthier, some are not, because I do have a family that lives in my home with some kids and they don't always want to be the healthy ones. So we're going to do that. I do have three beautiful, big, huge dogs that do like to make their presence known and sometimes when I'm making videos as well as my great niece and my great nephew who are six and five and they love helping in the kitchen and they want to be well the older one wants to be a cook when she grows up so now she's a chef but she wants to be a chef when she grows up the little one says he's her the sous chef and so he's learning too because I feel that if you're never too young to start teaching your kids about proper cooking, um, cooking, how the kitchen works. You know, I started out my twin nieces who are now 12. They started out in the kitchen with me as well as their grandma Jet when they were like two. I had them zesting lemons. We'd make pupusas. We would do shrimp, shrimp scampi. They learn early and when, when your kid is involved with making the food you get a lot of chances that they'll start trying different things and that's what we're trying to do you know have food that you don't so you don't be making chicken nuggets every night and yes I know little kids like eating chicken nuggets every single night if they could are my littles in my house are the same way Except for my niece, she is a fanatic about spaghetti sauce. So, we make spaghetti as much as we can. She's made lasagna. I'm telling you, never too young to learn. And don't ever discourage your children if they want to come help. Just, no matter how big of a mess, how crazy it is in the kitchen, just take the time and and teach them because it it's a skill everybody really should have and so I know today I'm just introducing myself but I'm gonna have a, another video up tomorrow and we are going to start with actually meal planning with the basics of breaking down your meats how to prepare a menu um, making your grocery list things like that so stay tuned for tomorrow and we will continue this series and get a lot of you either acquainted with the kitchen or more acquainted with the kitchen and we're gonna start making some good food because because that's what it's all about let's make some good food in here 
some of the recipes I have are from Pamper Chef. Some of them are my own. Some are just things I've learned over the years. Um, stay tuned tomorrow. Thanks.